Donc, rebonjour et bienvenue à notre douzième épisode sur The Walking Dead. Et on va terminer le troisième épisode de la saison 1. Euh, le quatrième épisode de la saison 1 aujourd'hui. Donc, on était rentré à Crawford, il y a plein de zombies partout. Je n'ai pas compris pourquoi, mais bon, hein, c'est comme ça, c'est comme ça. Je... Voilà. Voilà. Donc, on, euh, on sait que les vivres sont dans une école. Et c'est pour ça qu'il y a des casiers pour nous. Fuck! Fuck! Do you think they saw us? I don't think so. I think we're good. For now, at least. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. Ben. No, this is good. Vernon's right. We can deal with walkers easier than armed guards. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Merci. Come on. I think I know which way to head. I got a bad feeling about this. Wow, quel cliché. Mais toi, t'es un bad feeling ambulant, merde. À part être grand écran, il fait rien. Hein. Puis être trop aussi. Je rigole, j'ai rien contre les C'est une blague. Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. La musique est ultra creepy déjà. Je sais même pas si on l'a déjà entendu depuis le, le début de notre aventure, mais euh, elle est creepy as fuck. Ok, pour ceux qui, qui trouvent que c'est pas assez clair, la danse est euh, l'armerie. Voilà, je sais pas si c'est assez clair, mais euh, je pense que oui. Hein. <rire> like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Pourquoi on fait pas des groupes, nous aussi? Here. Just give me a sec. Okay. Ça en fait déjà 10. Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Vu la tranche que t'as fait, je sais pas. Hein? Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. So then we just need a battery. This auto shop. It's right next door. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Je laisse encore un Ben. Wow. 
what about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Oh, okay. <laughs> Act before you know it. You okay, Clem? Yeah. This Ash. desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it, being in school. Me too. I used to be a teacher, remember? Tell you what, when we find ourselves a safe place, set up a little classroom. Just you and me. Will there be homework? No homework. <laughs> Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? I don't think so, Clem. I think the best we can hope for is that we'll find a way to survive, to stay together, and to not let this change us. That's what's important. I guess you're right. Je peux pas lui mentir. J'ai parlé à Ben. Hey, you need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? You're plenty useful. Ha, <laughs> yeah, right. Seems like all I ever do is get us into trouble. Well, uh, I'll let you get on with it. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. I agree. I think you should tell him. Why? Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. Ben, listen. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose. But he's still in a real bad place. You tell him now, he's gonna lose it. And then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it. But it's not now. Not yet. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. Tu voulais mon opinion, je te l'ai donné, merde, arrête de me faire la gueule, oh pas. Oh là là. On se calme. The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Ouais, ouais, je m'en viens, merde. Je me donne deux secondes, Chris. Je m'en viens. Bitch, bye. <rire> Euh, je viens pour te couvrir tes arrières. Euh... Ouais. Whatever. But where the hell is Molly? Elle a pris une longueur d'avance. Mais là, si j'ai bien compris, il va voir Kenny, Molly sur le bateau. Molly, you out here? Ben, c'est sûr qu'il montera pas parce que Kenny ne fera jamais monter. Moi et je sais pas, moi et Clem. Il y a combien de places sur le bateau Je sais pas. Les livraisons à l'arrière. Ouais, 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 meuf. Je t'ai vu. Herman's. This is the place I'm looking for. Ok. Des barbelés. <rire> well, climbing the fence isn't an option. 
on a bit. Get too close. Get Turkish Vesco. Uh, what? Leave him! He's mine. Okay. Nice to see you. You got it. One more Ugh. for luck. Okay. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. <sighs> Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Okay. Oh yeah, that'll work. What? And then she was a gun. Oh, I creep my sir. He meant pas more. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Okay. Ah, no. Yeah, they are fresh. Can't reach it up there. An air function. That blinking. Must be an anti theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. Uh, I think it's like the machine there, no? Uh, no, hey, no. no power. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. It's locked. No way in. Ah, but you Nick. <laughs> Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Come to pick. Hey, Molly. Something you need? What was all that about back there? He came at me up on that rooftop. Tried to take a bite out of me, so I took care of business. What, you got a problem with me killing geeks? Nah. It just seemed like you went to town on him a little more than you needed to. Hey, you never really know when those things are all the way dead. I was just making sure. Look, you want to get this battery or not? Time's wasting. What do you think happened to Crawford? Don't know, don't care. As far as I'm concerned, these fuckers got what was coming to them. Not a lot of sympathy for all the people who died here, huh? I have about as much for them as they did for the sick and the old and anyone else they didn't think was fit to belong in their little paradise. 
So yeah, fuck them. Okay. Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. Thank you. I did it. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's probably not good. No shit. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry. There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. It's off. The negative terminal's still screwed on. Got that one off. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. What? Okay, you okay, me. Move your ass! Great, now what? That might be. Right over. Skyline. Ah, oh, no, mail. It's shut. Shoot it out! Okay, so now we're on the roof. You ever stop complaining? Come on. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! What did you call me? Now that you mention it. <laughs> voilà, c'est tout. Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you've still got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Ollie! God damn it, what the hell is she doing? But we don't have the battery. Hey, smart ass. Why you do you Can't open it without the combination. Okay. each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Okay, pourquoi il y a une musique bizarre? Okay, pas de soucis. You're back! Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. 
Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. How long have you known Vernon? Couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together. Kept us alive. Okay. <laughs> Donc t'as survécu quand même quand C'est quoi ce So you're a cancer survivor like Vernon and the others. Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. Lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? Mais c'est ironique, mais ouais. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old. Even children. Those least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. Okay. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. But it's correct. It's correct, Bree. I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. Okay. Shit. <laughs> Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. Plus. Correct. Euh, mais c'est vraiment dur avec les joystick, hein. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. Can we just guess the combination? It's a four-digit code. You do the math. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Okay. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. What? Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Um... Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Une cassette? How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Hey, Doc, uh... I just wanted to thank you for coming with us, and for all your help. I really appreciate it. Don't mention it. It's times like these we've got to help each other the most, right? And we're no better than those Crawford sons of bitches. I heard <laughs> that. How much time do you think Omid has, Doc? You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him some strong antibiotics to start fighting that infection, the better. Let's just leave it at that, huh? 
Okay. Molly helped me get the battery we needed. That's great. One down. Where is she? She took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off? With the battery? Yeah. Don't worry. She'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More the mercenary kind. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. Ah, ok, je pensais que c'était pour les, mais le dossier médical. Ok, pas que j'ai une vidéo. C'est quoi? What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. Il y a ça? There's dried blood on this printout, and on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there, then out the door. What the hell happened here? Ah, il y a 10 caméras. Elle est où la caméra Ah. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Okay. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. We maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Just like a new joke, there. Ah. Si j'y vais puis qu'il y a rien, les voleurs seront tirés à vue. <rire> ok. What the fuck? What the fuck? C'est quoi qui est tombé dessus? Ok. Je vais vous le j'ai du C'était mieux d'avoir quelque chose. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Shit, time okay. to go. Qu'est-ce que je avoir besoin de trois chiffres pour être ouvert? Oh, l'armurie! Non? Ah, je peux. Oberson. Ok. Et ben. A 
I found another tape. This one's dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. C'est pour ça que tout le monde est mort à Crawford. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Hola. <coughs> Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We'll take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You go on ahead. I want to make sure we didn't miss anything. I'll be right behind you. Don't take too long. What the fuck? Mais c'est quoi son problème à elle? Est-ce qu'elle est encore là? Non, ok. Ben on va s'en aller, qu'est-ce que je fais ici? Jesus Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Mm-hmm. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. Sure there's nothing you want to tell me? Yeah, I'm sure. Are we done? What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. by those bells uh, and then I heard someone coming uh, what the fuck are you doing out here Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory he sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open I found this on my... <gasps> uh, Ben where did you get that I just found it it was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there oh no oh, shit <laughs> It wasn't me! 
Good going, kid. Nice shot. Thanks. Ooh. High five. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! This is my fault, all my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Fine. Go ahead. Tell him. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... <laughs> Kenny, enough! Calm down, man! You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dad! My wife and child! You got them both fucking killed! Kenny, I said calm the fuck down! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny. I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure! Take a vote! This is America! Fuck it! But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? What? Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? <laughs> I've seen enough of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. I vote Ben stays with us. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? No, the balloon Now can we go? Oh, Damn shit. right. Vernon, come on. Puis non, ils ont pas leur mot à dire parce que c'est pas notre groupe. Ils vont pas avoir Ben sur le dos, OK? So burn. much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking hey, great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Never mind. Ah! <laughs> it's not going to hold. Back upstairs! Lee, look! Thanks, you girl. 
Lifesaver. She's got a buddy there. It's all right, Cliff. I'm fine. Ouais, ouais, mais on a pas temps, on a pas temps. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! Qu'est-ce qu'on a avec le train? Oh, la horde. Oh, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Come on, let's go! Let's go! Oh, it's the Je sais très bien que ça veut dire Kenny, puis nique toi. No fucking way. Why not? Genre on est tous dur avec lui, mais en fait il veut juste aider. C'est un enfant. Il a quoi, 16 ans, 15 ans? No way, là. Krista, everything okay? Oh me. Quoi, il est mort? Une fucking farce. Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Mm -hmm. uh. Hey. Back already? We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. Yeah. Voilà. <laughs> you okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind when we had the chance. Arrête. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Uh, okay. Listen, man, about what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. Why? What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. Why? And I know you want what's best for her. But this Why? plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. 
What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me, to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. It's and now Crawford's him. fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? The call is... I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. Ben, décollez, puis dis-moi pas comment prendre soin d'elle. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. I've already been brushed over better. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Okay. Listen. I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. Comme c'est mignon. Mais ce sera jamais que Lee dans notre cœur. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Promis. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Loin. We'll go wherever Kenny says. He's a good captain, and he knows the water's down south. He'll know where to take us. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Ben's a good kid. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's gotten to feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. sans comme les méchants dans l'histoire. Non. Je m'excuse. Avant nous détester. Euh, Clementine. Clementine? Hey, Pasi. Hey, oh, Gamine! 
Deu là, wesh. Clementine? Clementine! Oh god. Fuck off. Ben on l'avait sur nous il y a 3 secondes d'écart. Euh, on peut regarder les pédales pour un moment. Fuck man. Est-ce qu'on s'est fait une arme out here it ain't safe lee where's clementine she's not in her room vernon ain't in the house either what the, what the hell is going on whose blood is that it's mine oh my god no way no no fucking way there's no time to worry about me clementine's gone there's no chance she just wandered off on her own no no way and who the hell took her i don't know Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clementine's my responsibility. Can't ask any of you to risk your lives over this. This is something I have to do alone. We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Are you sure about this? Could be dangerous. As opposed to what? Day-to-day -day life these days? You're sure, Lee. Just lead the way. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine, and I am a Christian man, but I keep asking myself, if this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. Quoi? Kenny, you know what Clementine means to me. She's my family now. She's all I got. Hell, in the end, family's all that matters. And you were there for Katya and Duck when it mattered most, I guess. All right, I'm in. What about you, Ben? Now hold on a damn minute. I'm not going if this little shitbird is, too. Lee, you want to bring Clementine back alive, you'll leave him behind. He fucks up everything he touches. Deal with it, Kenny. The way I see it, Ben still has a chance to make things right, if he wants it. How about it, Ben? I don't know. But whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? You're right. I owe her. I want to do this for Clem. I want to do it for Kenny, too. I gotta make it right with him. Somehow, I gotta make it right. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he took her. Let's head out. 
What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? If someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? Men, what the fuck, so who? Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Je sais pas combien ils sont, mais ils sont une gang. Une gang bang! Mais c'est une horde. Ah, oh, c'était pour ça qu'ils nous demandaient pour le train. You son of a bitch! Holy! Oh. Vernon! Put Clementine back on! I want to talk to her! This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Je vais faire attention à ce que je dis. T'es mort, ça enfant de merde. Je vais pas j'ai des marche, c'est pas correct. Donc, le garçon dans le drone, 25% des joueurs l'ont tué. Ok. Avez-vous menti à Vernon ou menacé 58% ont été honnêtes et lucides, ce qui est une bonne chose. Avez-vous pris Clementine avec vous en allant voir Crawford Oui, comme 55% des gens. Avez-vous laissé tomber Ben 53... Il y a 47% des gens qui ont fait « Ouais, ciao Ben !» Oh non Puis, la morsure... 82% des gens l'ont montré. Ok. C'est bon, je suis content de mes choix. Ah! Qui a accompagné Lee? 16% des gens ont tout le monde. 18% des gens sont allés que avec Kenny. 6% sont allés seuls. Ok. Mais j'aurais besoin de toute l'aide que je, que je peux avoir. Je suis dégoûté. Je suis dégoûté. Je sais même pas quoi dire tellement je suis dégoûté. On n'a pas de preview. Ok, ben vraiment cool, hein. ben on va se dire bye. Hein. Donc euh, merci d'avoir regardé. Prenez soin de vous et on se revoit au prochain épisode pour euh, le début de la fin. Voilà, voilà. Donc d'ici là, ciao, ciao.